So tell me, are you still looking to make this switch from the mouse to the trackpad? Well, I'm going to help you make the switch. Hi everyone, this is Tim Brown. Welcome to my Apple Podcast. You're not going to believe this, but I actually work in an environment where just about everyone has a Mac. Yet, I'm the only one that uses a trackpad. And I just started to think to myself, wow, I wonder if there are a lot of other people out there who have yet to make the switch from the mouse to the trackpad. We're doing this episode, I'm going to show you all the features of the trackpad. And when I'm done, hopefully you'll be ready to make the switch. Okay, let's begin with one finger tap. It's a simple motion where you just tap to initiate an action. The best way to do this is to initiate a link by tapping on it. Two finger tap. The two finger tap allows you to bring up a menu when you tap over a word. This gives you the option to look it up in Google or in a dictionary. And there's also three finger double tap. This allows you to highlight a word as well as bring up the dictionary as well. And here's an example of how the video demonstrates this in system preferences. Three finger drag. With three fingers you can drag your application around on the screen as long as the cursor is positioned along the top of the application. Here's an example of how I do that in iPhoto. Two finger scroll. Real simple, you just scroll up and down a page. It, it works best in a web browser. Two finger pinch. This allows you to zoom in and out. Pretty simple. Expand out with two fingers, expand in. Here's how I do it in iPhoto. Two finger double tap. This is another quick way to zoom in and zoom out. I demonstrate this on a web page where I just zoom in to get a closer detail. Two finger rotate. This enables you to rotate a photograph from left to right clockwise and counterclockwise. Two finger swipe. This enables you to navigate between pages within an application. Again, works best in a web browser. Four finger swipe. This enables you to swipe back and forth between applications rather than within an application. And this is how I do it on a desktop. Four finger swipe up. This is what brings up mission control. And this can alternate with three fingers too, depending on how you set things up. You can pinch with three fingers and a thumb. This brings up launch pad. So you're pinching in to bring up launch pad and then pinching out to return. And you can pinch out with three fingers and your thumb. And you can clear off your desktop that way. So the difference is you're pinching out first rather than pinching in. That's simple. 
Well, thanks for tuning in for another episode of My Apple Podcast. My name is Tim Brown. I'll see you next time.